Hi everyone, this is Jeffrey at Ripe Color and this is Nancy Jean in the Garden. And we, uh, this is the Daily Duo. We read on five energies of the day, if you're new or if you're not new. <laughs> you get to hear it every uh, time anyway. <laughs> the, uh, the energies we read on are body, mind, spirit, grounding, and clarity. I read five cards. Nancy Jean reads five stones. Uh, please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. We both offer physical goods in the physical world. I make uh, textiles and I also offer IET, which is a healing modality. Nancy Jean has gardens and grids. Mm -hmm. She also does readings. Um, please uh, join both our sites, both our uh, YouTube channels and um, all the information if you don't wanna purchase something is below. And I think that's it, right? That's it for right now. <laughs> I'm going to toss the stones now. Okay. Oh, only a couple. Okay, for body, I, I get the steadfast one. So, mm -hmm. um, you know, he's he's like really reliable. <laughs> this one's really reliable you know this is like the plumber that you call that actually shows up and does his job that's, that's mm -hmm. like i'm gonna get the job done uh, no matter how long it takes you know he's very solid he's very solid and he accomplishes things he accomplishes things mm -hmm. now for mind you know you might feel a little overwhelmed but you're right at the end of feeling overwhelmed you're right at the end of um kind of carrying all this excess stuff, um, I think you're beginning to understand. It's like, this is uh, ancillary. This is not necessary. This is, uh, I have to, you know, take out of this what works and like let go of what doesn't work. That's what I'm getting. Now for spirit, I get this new uh, passion, this new creativity, this new idea, this new uh, way to move forward, right? It's a little, it's a little um, unformed, but there's like an inkling. Mm -hmm. For grounding, I get the, a sense of balance, a sense of community, a sense of um, being in the middle. I always like, I always see this card as being in the middle of, you know, understanding that giving and receiving are really the same energy. It's just opposite ends of the same energy. Right. So, right. There's like a harmony. Going You're part on. of a cycle. Right, right. There's a real harmony going on here. And this is also about perseverance. Mm -hmm. So if you have something that you're working on, especially with him here, mm -hmm. um, if you have something you're working on and, you know, part of you says, oh, I think I'm going to give up. It's like, no, 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 not quite yet. Mm -mm. Get the job done. And then you, then you could take your little break and have a little cheesecake or have a little tea or take a walk around the block or watch your favorite thing on YouTube. And then uh, for clarity, for clarity, I'm getting this, this sense of, um, how would I say this? There's like a, I don't know, a creative spirituality. Does that make sense? Yeah. That, that's what the, it's almost like, um, I think this, this newer understanding of how spirit can work in your life and being able to utilize it in a new way. That's what I get. I, not only that, but not being afraid of it. But what? Not being afraid of it. Oh, of, well, I don't even have a car for fear. I know. But I mean, yeah, but you live in your world and we're talking to other folks, Jeffrey, here. <laughs> so are we done? Yes. Okay. There. <laughs> Uh, it's interesting because when card when when cards when uh, stones fall in across lines if this was on this line then I'd have to read both of them but I had a couple of them this one came really close to the line and the only one that crossed the line was spirit so when that happens it means the energy's here and the energy for the body right now and this is body it's up here in the crown chakra and it says light force, uh, light force of life needs to guide your physical movement. So in other words, you're going to have to physically embody the life force that's coming towards you. 
You mm -hmm. understand what I'm talking about? Okay. Mm -hmm. um, um, and then the other stone that was out here in the chakras was the mind. And the mind is creativity mm -hmm. is the key to your security. Yes. Mm -hmm. So clarity, clarity landed in one of my favorite spaces. When I was writing out the, the description of these spaces, I wrote out, I need a space called go for it. And I was like, what a stupid name for a space, but I love it. And it actually goes back to a story from when I was a kid and I was learning golf and the guy, I couldn't see the pin. And he said, oh, just hit the damn ball. Cause I think I'd frustrated the crap out of the pro and I hit it and I made a hole in one. And so go for it means you're going to make a hole in one and you have the clarity to do that. Spirit is now aligned with all of your ideas and you are going to go straight to the end, use the lessons you've learned and you're getting new answers. So even mm -hmm. though you've been through this before, you're getting a whole new set of answers that's pushing mm -hmm. you to a new place. The only thing that's in fire, which is our ancestral spirit, is clarification comes from dealing things in your past. And I think that ties with this in that you're going to say, oh, but I've already been there. Yeah, you've been there, but now you have more knowledge. You have more ability to power it into your body and work with it. The only stone on this board that crosses two things is spirit. And spirit is in air and water. Air is when things are moving away, flowing, moving forward. Water is when they're flowing out, when your energy is moving out. It's, there's a different thing. This is more swords and this is more cups. Okay. So when you have spirit here, it's a spirit transforms your thinking and transmutation is complete. Mm -hmm. So that all ties together with the things that are out here. Mm -hmm. Your body is, is in the midst of getting divine life force guidance. Your mind's in the right space to be creative for your own security. And once you get these little pieces together and you are in a great space, a go for it day is not a day to be neglected. Like you said, it's not a day to go watch Netflix or YouTube. I mean, you can watch us and then you can turn YouTube off. Right, but do your work first. But do your work and, first. You know, and because of where the ancestors are, you know, it's almost like, um, to me, it sounds like, or it feels like um, you ask them for help and they're helping you. Right, right. To, to like, you know, because sometimes you're in the middle of a project, it's like, you know how people go, holy Jesus, or, you know, mm -hmm. you, um, whatever you say, mm -hmm. it's almost like you're calling that in and it's going to help you. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't feel overwhelmed and work from the best of your past and uh, yeah. you're, you're going to make it. So yeah. that that's the end of today. Blessings. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.